trip can sometimes feel like huh? leaving home for a second time. Raph, move it, girl, you're late! <sighs> it brings up those same unsettling feelings. Raph! Hmm? Raph, is everything all right? Mm. Come on, the angel bus is waiting for us. Anxieties, leaving behind the known, the safe, and heading into the mysterious and uncertain unknown. Mm. <laughs> all right then, all aboard. Okay, everyone, let's form a line and let's be on our best behavior. Yeah. <laughs> Same excitement to see your friends and the usual rivals. Raph, come on, I saved you a spot. Hmm. hmm. <sighs> Thanks a lot, Gabe. No problem. We're gonna have a really good time. Just like before, I have a knot in my stomach and a ball of confusion in my head. When I left home, I wondered if I would ever earn that radiant halo and become a guardian angel. But these days, all I wonder is, can I possibly hide my true feelings? Mm -hmm. hmm. It's all too quiet. I thought for sure we'd at least see some trouble from your devils. Me too. I'm a little disappointed. All right, are you ready? Just another second. Nosferatu, you know what to do? Ready. Excuse me, Uri, can I ask a favor of you? A favor? Depends on what. Oh, it's nothing, really. I just know you're interested in photography. Yeah, that's right. I was hoping you would take a picture of Kabbalah and I. We want a memory of the trip. Sure, I'll just use the DigiDream. No, wait, use mine. I don't want to have to chase you for the picture. Whatever you want. <laughs> It's really easy to use. Be sure to use the flash. Just calm down. I know how it works. Uh, All right, now strike a pose. Uh, big mm. smile. Gotcha! Mm -hmm. oh! uh. <laughs> <laughs> nice face! It's a real work of art. That wasn't funny. You guys are so lame. <laughs> Just who do you think you uh. are? You deserve it. I should throw another one. You do and you'll pay for it! Uh. Oh, now that's much more like my devilish class. I'm proud of you kids. All quiet, huh? You're right. I suppose I spoke too soon. I hope the human teachers are having better luck than we are. Can I offer you another snack? <laughs> Thanks. Here's something to wash it down. <laughs> <laughs> Here, this'll help your throat. Thank you. Try to get some rest if you can. 
with all the crazy rude behavior going on in this bus. You're not going to join in? No way. And why not? You always stick to yourself. Why is that? Because I can. Sure you can, but do you really want to? You guys stick to yourselves too. Yeah, but it's different for us. We're totally the new kids on the block. We're lucky when anybody talks to us. It'd take you five minutes to be friends with that gang. I prefer to stay clear of them. Knock yourselves out, girls. <laughs> if they keep going like this, we'll never reach the Caves of Obscurity. Well, we could always stop them. That's an idea. How much longer to the caves? We're practically there, don't worry. Rise and shine, we're here! Oh, finally! This is going to be an unforgettable trip. You really think so? Are you serious? These are the famous caves of obscurity? You know, on the flyers they looked really uh, kind of different. They give me the creeps. Maybe it's a mistake. The human driver may have taken a wrong turn. I really hope not. This place is... Horrible. Wow, I feel like I'm back home. Oh, you're right. We are going to have a really good time. What do you think, Selfus? Like I care. Uh, he's got his mind on other things right now. Don't start, Guardian. The two of them fight like cats and dogs. Yeah. But then again, who knows? Maybe that's the way they flirt. Get me? No, and I don't want to know, so drop it. You know, I was only joking, Raph. What are you waiting hmm? for? My sixth sense is going crazy. I just know that something here isn't right. What are you talking about? Jennifer, my earthly one. I have to go see her right away. I'll go with you. Let's get going. Mickey is right. It's horribly creepy. Come on, let's move it. Huh? <gasps> hey, Jennifer, we're here. Why am I so cold? Oh, you're burning up. <gasps> huh? Hmm. huh? I knew it. Her hmm? fever's worse. I told her to stay yeah. home. This is all my fault. Calm down, Uri. The Earthly Ones will solve this problem. You'll see. How do they do that? She needs a doctor, so how do they find one in the middle of nowhere? Huh? Come on, let's follow Andrew. Come on, boys, move it. The caves are waiting for us. Stay with your groups, you hear me? Sorry, Professor, but Jennifer's sick. A hundred and four degrees? She has to go to a doctor immediately. Jennifer's well-being comes before everything. We have to cancel the trip. I'll talk to the driver, and then let's talk to the students. I'll stay here with Jennifer. You see? Now we'll head back and everything will be resolved. Poor Jennifer is suffering. I just don't want anything bad oh, to happen to her. Oh, you'll see. She'll be okay. He was here a minute ago. Uh, driver? The driver disappeared. They can't find him or even the keys to the bus anywhere. Then the Earthly Ones aren't able to return back, are they? Yeah, that's right, and Jennifer's in trouble. Then I better go check on her. I don't like the idea of leaving my Earthy alone with just Uri. This is your fault. You convinced her. I was just doing my job, Cloudhead. Jennifer has free will. Kiberia's right, you know. The only thing we can try to do is influence the Earthly Ones. It's up to them to decide. I don't want to actually harm Jennifer. It's all right. Go to her, Kabiria. 
<laughs> well, at the very least, they'll call an ambulance or a... A doctor? I don't think so, because their cell phones don't seem to get reception out here. That's so not cool. Yes, and they're stuck here with no way of getting back. Smells like a trap, doesn't it? I was just thinking the same thing myself. Huh? Huh? Oh. Huh? <gasps> if the drivers disappeared, I can assume this is about us. I'd appreciate it if you came up with a plan. Yeah, we can't just wait around until whatever is going to happen happens. We will do what we always do. We will stay close to the Earthly Ones, and guard them. And tempt them. Raph, do you know how the human teachers decided to handle the situation? One of them is staying on the bus with Jennifer and Andrew. She keeps trying to make calls out on her cell phone. The other one is in charge of the class. You mean he's taking them into the caves? Mm -hmm. They decided that was the best thing. It avoids confusion on the bus and distracts the students till they find a solution. I can understand that. Get to work. Each of you still has your earthly one to think about. In the meantime, Professor Temtel and I will figure out what's happening and what's behind it. You heard him. Get out there and tempt. <clears throat> I strongly recommend you keep your eyes open. Be ready for anything. Hmm. Milady. Malachi, finally! Have you carried out my order? Mm -hmm. Everything is going according to your design. The humans are trapped and the immortals must stay with them. That is only the beginning. The most important part is yet to come. Do you know what you must do? Yes, mistress. When you give me the sign, that is the moment I spring the trap. I'm depending on you, Malachi. Don't disappoint me. I live to obey my mistress. This time, there is no escape. <laughs> Angels Angels Angie Town, the paradise you've always been. Moments